Hey guys, I'm Prodigy from Airsoft Team Kilo 2-3. Back again today, obviously, um, it's another batch of filming guns. Uh, we're doing more backyard reviews. Today we're doing gas guns because it's nice out. It's getting close to the end of summer and, you know, summer's just the gas season. Unless you live in California where it's freaking thousand degrees every day. This is my KWA USP Compact. USP compacts just have a special place in my heart, probably because it was in kick-ass, but whatever. I love the feel of this. This is one of the few pistols that I actually just grip normally. Just oh, I can't get over how much I like this pistol. Um, they don't shoot an amazing FPS. They're not insanely accurate because the barrel's just a few inches long. And they barely shoot, you know, 300, 320 FPS at the very most. I usually run uh, 2.8s or 2.5s on this guy. Uh, with those, they'll shoot 200 feet easily. This thing has an amazing range, but out past 100 feet, good luck hitting a guy. It's just, accuracy is not amazing on these. There isn't a lot to talk about with these. Um, the only two things I do not like about this is, obviously, being an HK replica, you need the rail adapter to put... Uh, lights, lasers, accessories on here, or at least most of them. Uh, I've got one on the way, I should be getting that in the next few days, hopefully in the mail. Uh, aside from that, the only other bad thing about this gun is it's not very uh, cold weather friendly. Uh, the KWA MP9s uh, that I put up prior to this video, uh, those are very, very good in the winter. Uh, you can run those in 40 degrees fine, and you can get at least a mag out of them. This guy probably get about half or at least three quarters of a mag out of it before you run out of gas, uh, at least in the cold. If it's like 60, 70 degrees out, you're going to be rocking two mags out of this guy before it runs out of gas. These are fantastic pistols. Uh, now, I guess another gripe I have, uh, I haven't really had problems with it, but it does have a plastic outer barrel. Um, I don't really care much. I would like it to be metal, but I haven't had problems with the plastic, so I can't really complain. I do love the HK trademarks, uh, USP Compact, 9mm, uh, I just love how they look on this. It's uh, The only difference between this and the real steel one is the real steel one does not have the little um, the white etching in here, it's, it's just matte into the uh, slide. Uh, aside from that, it's a very good replica, it's about the same weight as the real USP, and it's just a lot of fun to rock and roll. And I actually did uh, put a little spacer in here, and my dog's neighbor's dog's barking again, so yay. Somebody's <laughs> barking at my cats that are running around the yard here. But uh, I did put a little spacer on the spring guide rod here, so it does cycle just a little, little bit faster than it normally would. Now the mags for these guys run about 40 or 50 bucks a piece, as do just about all KWA mags. I got this off my buddy Jeremy for $150, came with two mags, and he gave me a Serpa holster with it too, and I just recently bought a third mag, so I got three mags for this guy. Now, the one thing I really liked about this is it never had an orange tip. It never got painted on, so I can only assume it was um, imported from one country or another, because the slide doesn't have it, the barrel doesn't have it. Never had an orange tip, so I really like that fact. I hate having to paint off or shave off orange tips. It's a hassle, and it usually makes your gun look kind of tacky sometimes. But easy gun to take apart, really easy to maintain, very realistic to the uh, real steel, considering for what you pay. Uh, the real steel is going to run you easily $1,000. Uh, this one, $150, huge price difference, but for that much money, it's a very good replica. I'm super happy with it. This is my primary sidearm, and I run this with every setup that I have. It's just my favorite little gas pistol, and I will never part with it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Prodigy from Airsoft Team Kilo 23. Still got some more guns to come. It's unbelievable. I know I got way too many guns, but still got more to come. Thanks for watching. Take it easy.